Hey y'all, so y'all know how if your young boy got into it with his seventh baby mama or Cola yesterday. Um, well, they're still arguing today. She went live, broke down the argument, and spilled a little tea. She still hasn't went to go get her son, but she did take to her store to say a few things, and I'll go ahead and show that and also play the clip. Marcola took to her story and said, Whitey said, if you don't come get KL, he's going to bad rules. To which she replied, I hope God gets you before the people do. I'm trying to be funny. First, it was come get him me all right get my ticket yb said i can't get the ticket okay i'll get my own uh actually yb said he's going to monique you can't come get him um no he's not i just said i'm getting my ticket so what's the issue now i'm gonna change their phone number and not fix me back that bitch don't help with shit he's a liar he ain't gave nobody a million dollars he said he gave all his baby mama, like, but like, I don't need it, and I don't want I'm it. I'm working on it. I know he ready to get the f*** out of the house. That man probably yelling at my baby, pinching him, and that shit. That's that weak ass song. That shit weak as f***. I know you did not take time out your day to go make that weak ass shit. Mm -hmm. Now, when I go make my dish song, I've been out here, I'm bitter, none of that. <laughs> it's the kids really calling me bitter, like. Mm -hmm. What would I be bitter about when I'm out here doing me? I don't want that man. I swear to God, on my baby, I don't want that man. Like, what the fuck is wrong with y'all? Why do y'all think people life revolve around that man like that? Like, are you, are y'all f***ing crazy? He's definitely mentally unstable, and he needs help. And I'm going to need everybody around him to start telling that bitch when he's wrong. I care my baby because I, like, this was y'all not, in, let me break this down right fast. When I kept my son, me and him departed ways. We didn't say anything to each other. He came back bothering me because he wanted to be there. I was fine. I was doing everything by myself. Wasn't asking for nothing. He came back. And I let him. Fuck, I was gonna do say no. I ain't beg him. I ain't blow his phone up. I ain't threaten him with shots for I ain't do nothing. I was doing me. Taking care of my kid, getting everything by myself. You came back disrupting my peace. You came back bothering me. You came back selling me dreams. You're mentally and you're not all, all the way there like you have a girlfriend but you're trying to sell me dreams you have everything you claim you wanted but you're trying to sell me dreams you're trying to make me seem crazy it's giving narcissists and manipulators but y'all are too young to understand that but i don't never fucking fall for them bullshit ass games like i'm out here doing me he do him i'm not bigger i'm mad that I'm out here having fun, and you keep trying to play with our fucking kids that you begged me to bring out there. It's giving you never really wanted the baby. You was just trying to see me when I came out there. That's what it's fucking giving because now it's come get the baby, but you begged me four days to bring him. On FaceTime, you was begging me to bring him, and I was just like, okay, fuck it, let me fucking bring him. But I know what it was. But you just wanted to see me. You didn't, you don't. Get about the baby because and I, this is how i know you don't because now i mean you're not cool it's come get the baby mm. we got bitch. i'm over this shit i'm over it i'm over him and i'm over all you childish ass fans that's sticking beside this weak-minded ass go get that man some help okay that's what y'all can do y'all talking about why am i bashing him why did he bash me on the phone like the Really? If I keep speaking on it, obviously I care. Like, stop being stupid. I don't regret having a kid, but I feel bad that my son has to have a bullshit ass father. That's kind of fucked up. Did he get mad about that? Bitch, he is angry at that picture I posted. He took it in the wrong way, and I don't even really give a fuck no more. Command that picture.
He told me post the messages, and I'm just fed up. Y'all don't know half the shit I didn't already went through with this man. Mm, definitely be careful who you sleep with. I like when stuff like this happens because it's all a lesson learned. I know I don't want to go through this again. Mind you, he been hella messy when he had his other baby mama call my phone and read me a message. Hating ass message that somebody sent me. Messy ass nigga. Like, you're a messy ass bitch. But I guess I'll do story time for you two now and just tell y'all everything. Anyways, why did I bring this to the internet? Maybe because he get in the songs capping about he want to see his kids, he miss his kids, this and that, his kids. Like, bitch. What do you mean I said something first? Yeah, he sent me a message. That message she posted and said, let me, let me, let me, let me say something. Yeah, it was, it was definitely her. Y'all right, it was her. He sent that message, that long message. I told him that you doing hell with shit, it was a joke. <laughs> then I told him again, like, you need to have somebody bring KL out here because I'm doing stuff. Then he had never responded. So this is when I get upset. Cause it was no problem for me to get KL, right? So then Jason texted me and Jason was like, there's nobody to bring KL. Please come get him. Like, I think the part that really irritated me was like, oh, it's hella hours later and you're really like trying to press me to come get our son. Like, it's really that deep. Like, I can understand if he sent me that message and then like 30 minutes to an hour later, Jason texted me that. But it's literally hours later. So, like, now I feel like you're really pressing me to come get my baby that you really begged me to bring out here. So, then I sent control that message. Sure, we can. And so on, so on, and so on. And then that's when he was like, he'll be at an Airbnb. I don't know. And starstruck. I can't believe I'm even going through this lame ass shit. Like, mm. cool beans, kiddo. Cool motherfucking beans. He's still cheating on that bitch. Well, my bad. He don't call it cheating. Sorry. I'm gonna just find my business. Let me stop. I would never talk to that man ever again in life. Yo. Y'all don't really know me. When I say something, I mean it. I'm sorry. I don't have shit to talk about. We don't even have a kid in common no more. Yeah, like if I was mad about him having a girlfriend, you really think I would have sent my son over there? No. I'm telling y'all, I do me. Sis, get us a two-piece like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> life don't stop for no nigga are you stupid it's not mine it's my shit gonna go on oh, y'all psyched out mm. no 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 my son ain't had no Airbnb he didn't have a girlfriend when I was with him I was with that man for a whole month every single fucking day I don't got shit but a hundred problems Y'all keep asking, did I pick my baby up? Did y'all go pick y'all baby up? My son, fine. And if he not, then guess what? My is is going down like James Brown. Until then, hey, I got shit I need to do. So if you really want him gone, have somebody bring my baby out here. After you begged me to call out from work, which I did, and I went out there. Oh, you going to have somebody bring him out here. That's what the fuck you going to do. That's what the fuck you're going to do. I'm not acting like no child is in danger. If my child was in danger, I would be out there. What are you saying? Yeah, I'm about to do a YouTube and give y'all some the story times y'all have finally been wanting. I tell y'all every motherfucking thing. Everything. I hate this jail. I have a car. 
I do want a new one though. He said I blew that. I put that. <laughs> I don't give a It's just like, come on, man. It's nuts. I do everything for myself. Like, man, look at it. You already have a car. I just wanted a new one. But I, I already have a car. I can go get my own. Wifey sister T Lee got on Twitter and said, you really gotta have kids with people you really know. This internet should be outrageous. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. If you're still watching, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely let me know how you guys feel about this video. See you next time.